we go. Frame, Frame six. six of a possible Mario nine. Yes, and uh, now Luca Bussell has got to do what Olivia Sullivan did. If a mistake does come, and of course Sullivan is playing well now, but you know, Luca has got to capitalise. He's got to be ready, switched on for it. A terrific game so far. What? I think the problem Luca's got is that Sullivan seems to be playing as well as ever now. He's completely switched on to the job at hand a terrific red well, he's gone into the bunch once already this time not interested in playing it because there are reds out and he's on one because at some point he'll have to get into the pack but not yet six Seven. I think this is the moment, especially with the one red out, he can use that one as a likely next red and split the bunch and see how that goes. And there's an example of how to get the bunch open with a red in play, not wait until there aren't any reds in play. Fourteen. This gives you extra options, extra positional options. There's never been a better break builder than this man. Fifteen. Strange. What has changed in this match is when Luca got to the front, there was a, a real adrenaline rush that he was 22. on. And one or two shots became um, a little too much for him. Just one or two, but O'Sullivan has just a little bit of calm to proceedings 23 he seems as in concentration as i've seen him for a while here Tonight. Well, there's the mistake that I was speaking about that Luca is going to have to prey on. I didn't see that one coming. He was looking very good. He looked up at the crowd as if something might have distracted him slightly, but that's just the way it is. Not an easy starter for Luca, though. Very much in this match, Brussel. He's playing as well as I've seen him since he won the world title. <laughs> but this is a tough opening red. Yeah, you could see from the side on view actually how far this red is away from the pocket. It's foreshortened on that angle. Yeah, and he's missed it. Not easy. Yes, and he's a good rest player, but um, he might be one of the very best players in the world using the rest he's good enough One. cue ball just trickling into a position behind the blue which he was looking for when we last saw it just short of that Again, it's a task to get from colour to red here. 
Bulls have still got a little bit of distance between them, though. Seven. Just getting further and further out of position in this break now. Now, has he got the shot off the blue to run round of two cushions and open the bunch? I don't think that, that shot is there. The green looks to be in the way. So he'll play the green perhaps on the bottom red by the black. And if O'Sullivan is struggling to see a shot, there probably isn't a shot that gets him round the table. Back on the blue. I think he, the problem he's got, if he plays the blue, it looks either in off or that little gap between the green and the cushion is very hard to locate. Shot though, isn't it? On the loose red. There's an angle on his next colour, almost certainly the black, which will be the key to the frame, I would say. straight enough. I don't think he can go into these. Oh, he could only play it really slowly. He wanted to play it with more pace, but he was swung wide, so he just nipped it and got Eight. into them, but not very many reds moved for that reason. is uh, another shot that's uh, important either he plays on the bottom red or he goes blue into the pink and gets the reds open that the target is not wide so maybe on the loose red and already he's chalked up a lead of 53 points he's not really been on the ball yet be an absolutely 32. sensational positional shot if he's on that red because he really didn't have a lot of room I think that is exactly where he had to finish it's a beautiful shot he's played there well the pink will do It'll be 68 in front with 67 on you saw him sort of squinting at the scoreboard in the heavens there but this is the ball that leaves Brussel needing a snooker Certainly not a conventional break, but he kept it going. His focus. It's, we saw when the 39. person was in his eye line how annoyed he was. You know, all this stuff about I'm here to have some fun. He's here to win. Of course he is. I can think of many a tour player who wouldn't have tried to go into the bunch there in knocking that pink in because it's a snooker needed, and that might be the one chance of losing the frame, miss the pink, and open the reds. Yeah. You're right. It's been a really difficult break, but this has been a gem of a break, actually, in the context of this match. So it looks like 4 2, and <laughs> even though it's only a two frame lead, it feels like a long way back for Brussel just because of how well O'Sullivan's playing here. Missed that one, so half chance, there's three snookers needed, but in fact he's staying in his seat. 
The match has turned really on that Miss Black in frame four, you've got to say, from Bussell. He was 2-1 up at that point, but O'Sullivan now leads 4-2, and he's just one away from becoming the first ever winner of the Riyadh season World Masters of Snooker.